Hey guys, Wayne here from Tech Made Easy. Today I want to show you how to marry your Samsung Galaxy Soul 3 to your TV using a Chromecast. To do this, there's three things you're going to need. The first thing is you will need uh, an HD TV that has an HDMI connection. The second thing you'll need is home Wi-Fi. And the third thing you'll need is a Chromecast device. Now Chromecast will cost you around, uh, starting at around $30 and, and it goes up from there, there's different models. Um, you can get them at any brick and mortar retail location like Best Buy or basically any online website that sells them except for Amazon because they don't like Google. So what you're going to do is after you have your Chromecast plugged in and set up, you're going to switch your TV to the um, input that your Chromecast is plugged into. And then you're going to come back to your phone and make sure your phone is connected to Wi-Fi and go ahead and verify that. After that, you're gonna uh, download the Google Home app. You just go to the Play Store and just type in Google Home and this app will come up. It'll only take a few minutes to download. Once it's downloaded, you're gonna go ahead and click on the Google Home app. And just a couple of prompts that will ask you to go through. So getting started, okay, location stuff. I always hit deny, next, okay. So here you're gonna be on your home screen. This is the main home screen for the Google Home app. Now, from here you're gonna go to the accounts tab all the way to the right and swipe up until you get to mirror device. Go ahead and click on mirror device and these prompts, don't worry about them. We're gonna go ahead and just click those away. So I always check the box. So check don't show, hit okay and then hit cast screen slash audio. Now here it's gonna show your Chromecast device. Now when you set it up, it will ask you what room you're gonna put it in and then it'll change the name according to what room you have it in. So I have it in my office, so it's named Office TV. I'm gonna click on there. And at this point it will, you'll see that the screen is mirrored to the TV. And at this point, whatever I do on my phone, it will show up on the TV so I can for example go to YouTube I can go to Google Chrome I can browse articles I can open up a game I have Candy Crush on this phone so let's say you wanted to play Candy Crush and show your family the latest round that you're on you could do that it would mirror right to your TV and it'll allow you to play it and just show everyone in the room what you're doing so that's just one example of how the mirroring works. I want to show you specifically a video because a lot of people will mirror their screen so that they can show videos and you can use this method to do that, but there's a better way. So I'm going to show you this way first and then I'm going to show you the way I think it's a little bit better. So let's go ahead and click on a video. Let's just go to this video. And so if we wanted to show in the full screen, I'm just gonna take the phone and rotate it. And the video should rotate or you'll have to tap it, hit that button there, and that will make it play in the full screen. So now you can see it is showing on the TV, but the downside is that now you can't use your phone because everything on your phone is being shown on the TV. So here is the better way to do it if the reason you're trying to mirror your screen is simply just to watch videos. So. First thing you want to do is swipe down from the top and look for the option that says casting screen. If you tap there, it'll take you back to the Google Home app and we're going to disconnect. Now we're going to go home, back to YouTube, and we're still on that same video, okay? So I'm going to tap on it and in the upper right corner of the video, you'll see this icon, which is the cast icon. We're going to tap on that. I'm going to go back to my office TV and now it's only going to send the video to the TV. So the cool thing here is that the video is now going to play on the TV. It won't play on my phone. It'll actually play in a better quality. And now I don't have to worry about not being able to use my phone. I can continue to do whatever I want on my phone and, and that video is going to play uh, on its own on the TV. So. To me, that is the easiest way to do this. And when you're ready to turn off the video or disconnect the cast, just swipe down. 
and you'll see the video is here. You can just click on this little X right next to the video. You can pause it from here, or you can hit the X to totally close it out, and that will stop the video from playing altogether. And essentially, that's it, guys. That's how you mirror your screen to your TV using a Chromecast. I hope you guys did find this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Uh, thanks again for watching. Take care and have a good one.